steps too patiently as she unraveled. He planned ahead for the change of mind, and not so soberly as he changes. She is terrified by the electric gaze. In his eyes, so nonchalantly, he grabbed his coat and his tea, and he looked down at her feet as he said goodbye. It's not what he wanted. It's just that he knew that he had. There was no going back. Something like this, and so he got in that piece of shit car and drove it as far as it take him. Just barely 500 miles, and he looked back and smiled because the only life he'd ever known. He just left 500 miles behind. Don't get paranoid. No one's getting annoyed at your stupid jokes, except for yourself. They're happy to have another head talking instead of a sponge. In the corner of the room. Well, with my sailor's heart and this businesser's body. I live in a college kid's home, and I've got these friends that party. It gives me a vicious attention span. Yeah, I've got friends and things that need me there, man. It's all really not fair, but it is what it is. This is how it's gonna be. I guess I'm trying, but who's really trying? Aren't we all just giving about ten percent? Because who wants to be mooched off of down till their last penny cent? It all kind of makes sense. I've got this bird's wings hidden underneath my skin. That is reptilian, so I can pull all the heat in for my cold-blooded heart. I live in a dark cave, and it may make me blind as a bat. But I can somehow stay 